How you doing? Jamel. Maria. And I am going to teach you how to make spore samples with King Strafaria mushrooms. And King Strafaria is edible, non-poisonous, and cultivated oh. all around the world. Top is slimy, you feel that? Feel it? Yeah. Yeah, it's gonna show you how to make spore samples of the ones I found in the backyard. Oh, wow, my <laughs> God. <yes. laughs> all right, so we got a little bit of water here. Um, we got a syringe, a medicine syringe that we use for Tylenol or whatever. I labeled my paper already. King Shufaria, I know it's backwards. King Shufaria and um, yes. the the technical name, Shufaria Rogoso Nulata. I said that right. So Nulata, Rogoso Anulata. <laughs> yeah, that was that one right there. And then, uh, so King Shufaria, we are going to make score samples. What you want to do is gently, gently twist the stem at the base of the cap as much as you could. I know sometimes it doesn't work out how you want to. Oh, you heard that breakage? Uh, coming off. Let's go. There we go. Uh, 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 I got it. I didn't do it too good because I, I got a little bit left in there. So what I want to do is just move a little bit of it as much as I could. See? I said I'm so now, Put that right on the paper. On the paper, just like this. That's perfect. So it's on top, have a little bit of space so it can leave a spore print. Next is what you want to do. Got your syringe. Here, you want to do it? Fill the water. Fill the syringe with water. Squeeze it. Put the water out. There you go. Now drop a little bit on the cap. One, yep, that's it. That's enough. And then cover it. Now we do the next one? Yeah, and now we wait about, I would say, I do normally do 24 hours, but I've seen it work in 10 to 12. But now we're gonna do this one. It's cute. She likes it, she's like, it's cute. <laughs> so? It's like a me. It's cute like you? Yeah. I think you're a little cuter than the mushroom. Yeah, I'm gonna cute than a mushroom. Right, so what we do is we take, just one. we take the oh, stem, twist it at the base of the okay? cap again. A little off. Yeah, just a little off. Not too bad. That wasn't too bad. Get it like that so you see all the gills. Yeah. Any excess stem that pokes out from the top of the cap, we can take off. And now I'm gonna take, let me demonstrate. Okay. Fill it with water. Well, you did the last one. Let me do this one. Fill it with water, and then one, two, three. That should be enough. Then cover it with a cup, Tupperware, it doesn't matter. And then, and then we let it sit for anywhere from 10 to 24 hours. I feel spores. like one hour. Feels like one hour, and then that's pretty much it. Um, yeah, so. I will finish this video tomorrow and then we'll put it out. Da, da, da. <laughs> oh, look at that. The other one's like extremely saturated. So I left them up there a little too, too long. Sure, yeah, see, that one's a little saturated. Show them the other one too. Mm, try not to touch them. Okay. There you go. It's a little, still a little damp, but you get the picture. Other ones, the other two are extremely saturated. I was from up there too long, but this one's good. So yeah, pretty much concludes how you get spore samples from mushrooms.